Hi guys, this is AndroidPio.com and I'm here with a game called NBA Live Mobile. It's available for free in the Play Store and I'm playing it on the Samsung Galaxy A7 2016. This is a pretty large phone, so it's excellent for playing this basketball title. So we have daily events right here. We have shooting drills, we have head-to-head uh, -head matches and the season. Well, in the regular season, we're not doing so fine. Back-to-back -back defeats. So let's play a game. I'm controlling sort of a Lakers because just like the FIFA titles, this is basically sort of an ultimate team game. Okay, so let's turn up the volume a bit. The other guys have started playing and let me quickly explain to you the controls. So we have this stick here to move around. We have a pass button, obviously. We have the drive button, which we can use to sprint. And then we have a shoot button and we almost score the basket. When we're on the defense, we have a block and guard button. We can keep the guard button pressed, but that doesn't quite work all the time. So pass again. Drive can be used to sprint or can also be used to perform cool moves and then we get to finally shoot. You can also score three pointers but that's what triggers a meter like the um, free kicks you do in FIFA. Well that meter here doesn't apply to free kicks, it applies to shots and I'm going to go ahead and maybe try a three pointer. So here we go, you saw the meter and we just missed and that's it. It's player has a special ability, some can dunk, and for starters we don't have a very impressive team. They all have about uh, 60 ability points, and now I'm trying to guard. And now I can try to block him, but no luck. I also have a switch button, so I can switch players, then a pass button, then drive. We can also fake a shot, and finally we scored. So we're not doing that bad. Each quarter has about 2 minutes, so you have a blast playing this. You can uh, pause the game, come back later to it, I'm trying to guard right now, and... Yet another basket against me. The game is very fun, comes from Electronic Arts, obviously. And while it's hard and includes quite a few freemium thingies, the animations look stunning and the graphical engine is really, really well done. And that was a dunk. So I'm sprinting, I'm passing, I'm shooting, and I'm scoring, apparently. This game was launched in February 2016, so it's quite fresh yet. Okay, let's guard this player, then switch, and that was a decoy. You can also do combos of sorts by combining drive and shoot. Well, they just dispossessed me, so time to switch, mix it up a bit. And this guy scored with his back towards the board. That's crazy. Let's try another three-pointer. Nope. I'd say that about 90% of the time you will miss three-pointers. And when the last seconds come in, you'll score a dramatic slow-motion shot, which actually made it this time. We have daily challenges. We can create sort of a fantasy team, just like in Ultimate Team in uh, the FIFA titles. The controls are pretty intuitive, but you have to get a roster of good players, otherwise you'll totally keep losing and losing again. Okay, so that's the match I have against the Golden State Warriors. I am with the Los Angeles Lakers. Let's see the menus. This is my team right now. A fantasy team, those are the players. You can create the best lineup. We also have special skills for each player. Some of them have extra special skills. You can sell the position, point guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward. You can create a balanced lineup, you can focus on the small ball, defensive, and unlock uh, new strategies like big man and shooting, for example. This is the store area, where things get very pricey. We have a shooting pack, hoops pack, rookie pack, and player packs. They start off at uh, 5,000 coins or 100 NBA cash, which is very hard to come by. And then we have bundles, where you can end up spending real money. Then we have the sets, which are basically sort of achievements, as far as I know, and let's see what's happening here. We also have auctions, which I haven't accessed yet. Of course, you can auction players, which would actually be a smart move, considering we don't have that much money just yet. You can score much more money by playing the live events every day and challenges instead of your regular matches. So this is a head-to-head -head match 
against the Golden State Warriors gives me 200 coins. And let's play it. We have a stamina meter at the top with about 10 units. And one or two or three will be depleted with each match. So is the tip off. So far, so not good. Blocking these guys. And when playing against other Lear gamers, it's sort of like a turn based title. Okay, time for a three pointer. Nope, guess not. I think I have yet to score a three pointer in this game, although I do have a couple of matches attempted so far. Okay, I'm guarding this guy, and that was a dunk, and that's a big guy. Okay, passing now, driving, trying some cool things, and that was a dunk. So it's two against two in the first quarter and that's another big guy sometimes it's the small guys who are fast that do the really nifty tricks and that was a miss or nope it was a score so I'm controlling Miller now and close call this is one of the most fun titles I've played based on basketball lately of course it comes from electronic arts who else and it's very well done, except maybe for those freemium thingies, the stamina meter, the big prices for all the items, and the idea of uh, card-based players, well, that may not appeal to some people. In the end, if you're a basketball fan, you owe it to yourself to at least try this game. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. I had a blast. I played it on the Samsung Galaxy A7 2016. I suck at this game, as you can well see. But then again, my players also are, aren't that good. And that was a very nice 3-pointer. So 9.2 out of 10 from AndroidPie.com for this game. That's a blast to play on mobile. It's free, has a few freemium mechanisms, but in the end, you'll enjoy it. That's it from us. Bye-bye.